Welcome back, everybody. Today, we're going to look at some of the backdrops that I was able to print over at uh, Walgreens. This is a two foot by eight foot banner that uh, in their software on the website, I was able to create two uh, backdrops on the single sheet of paper. You can see I just kind of inverted uh, the images. So I was able to create, like I said, two of them out of one piece. And where we're going to put it on today is uh, the behind the Metrolink station here. You can see the panels that I have. And these panels are what actually cover up the, the uh, downgrade and upgrade that go up to the second deck. And so I'll take those things off and be able to show you the, the actual uh, grade that's behind there. So I made these removable, obviously, if we have any derailments uh, behind the backdrop. So... Yeah, kind of kind of a little rat's nest going there, but it works good. Uh, you can see the kind of the top deck there. So now I'm going to attach the uh, banner or backdrop to the actual uh, panels there. So uh, you can see there's a there's a crease there that uh, I have to work on, but I think it came out pretty good uh, as far as uh, out looking realistic and being far away. Um, you can see a couple trees there. There's a there's a couple points in where I had to splice the pictures together, and uh, I think that with with practice on this website or for Walmart, I'll, I'll be able to do a little bit better job. But what I had on the screen versus what got printed uh, wasn't exactly the way I thought it was going to turn out. The nice thing about Walmart is that you set that thing up and you pay, they'll have it done in, in less than an hour. You can just go down to your local Walmart and, and uh, they'll have it all printed up for you. So I, I literally put this thing together in a, a small amount of time and it already had it back at the layout in, in about an hour. So that was nice. So it, it's creating a little better scene uh, than just being plain blue uh, here at the, uh, the Metrolink station. Like I said, uh, that, that big crease that you see there, that's that's the, the uh, division point for the two panels. So, yeah, I was pretty happy with it. Uh, Wal Walgreens charges, uh, I think it's normally 36 bucks for the 2x8 uh, banner, uh, but uh, I was able to get a half-price deal. They, they do have quite a few uh, half-price deals uh, throughout the year, so be on the lookout for that if that's the uh, desired route that you want to take for making your backdrops. Now, I, this is just one way to, to make backdrops. There's, I, I, I'm still learning how to do all this stuff, and, and I know there's other ways to do these uh, with painting and stuff like that. So I, I will probably try a different uh, process next time. Not that this one was bad, but just to learn how to do other things. I'm gonna, I'm gonna uh, print out some. I'm sorry, some paint, some of the other backdrops, uh, especially up on the, uh, the top deck. But it'll be fun either way. And so, uh, like I said, 36 bucks, and I had it in an hour. Uh, so, with this scene here, obviously I'm looking at, uh, after the, that, when the backdrop's done, we can do, got some more signs that are gonna be going in. And uh, now we're looking at the branch line here. One of the locals uh, going through. So, yeah, backdrops, awesome. Uh, it, it makes the scene look way better, and I'm so happy that uh, it came out pretty decent. But uh, can only go up from here. There's a there's a lot more, a lot of other things I would do just to better splice the pictures together and uh, make it look just a little bit better as far as the uh the sky and everything like that but uh i guess we can put that stuff in photoshop and things like that so that's all stuff i'll be learning and and uh, bringing up in future videos so thank you very much for watching i really appreciate all the support uh please leave any any comments down below that uh if you have any ideas and uh look forward to talking to you all soon thank you